drop the puck on this opening faceoff. The Bruins will look to go on the offensive as they win the opening draw. Broken up with a little physicality. And he coughs it up with the pass. Greg Sinek loves it. Oh, how did he get a piece of that? Feeds the puck over to Barkov. Florida's ready to go on the attack. Moves it to Kachuk. Huge steal at his own end. Marchand's lugging the puck. Quick feed to Pasternak. Oh, stick save and a butte. Moves it quickly over to Kachuk. Saka's got it in the defensive zone. And that's deflected. Quick shot. And he had an answer with that save. Let's it fly. There's another stop. What a great job of tracking the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Puts a little mustard on the hit to knock the puck loose. The Bruins looking against the half wall. Stick save and a beaut by Bobrovsky. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame, we've still got zeros on the board. Offense is on face off and he wins the draw. And that's off a stick. Scoops up the puck here. Florida's got it along the wall. Oh, and an even bigger save on the slapper. Here's the shot. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Denies him! Van Riemsdyk's exploring options with the puck. Trying to escape the pressure. Oh, on the play! Wow! Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. And as play continues, this place is still buzzing and they're getting loud here now. Wow, this is all about fan appreciation for that huge save. And man, does this ever feel good. You know, you feel it right through you when you know you've made that big save. And everyone around you is appreciative. the puck. The Bruins will play the puck from behind the net. Quick pass to Kiki. On the attack along the boards. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Down the left wing across into the offensive end. Oh, saved it. What a stop. Now that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. And it's a quick pass to Eckler. Nowhere for that shot to go through. The Bruins move to the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by Carlo. Stopped by the goaltender. Pasternak's accurate when he's firing pucks that are flat on the ice. That's his snipe zone ability, and he likes to score from those types of shots. Kachuk's a creative player. His it's tricky zone ability means he's able to get shots by stick handling his way into highlight real plays. Now, as I send it back upstairs, I'll be watching out for one of these players to give their team a chance to win tonight. That'll do it for period number one. We'll drop the puck on the second period in just moments. They can't be scoreless if they want to win the game. The Bruins move it ahead. Here's a feed in front. Picked off in front. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. 
Boston's got to hold him in against the wall. Picked up along the boards by Marchand. Here's a chance, sends it in front. And it turns off a twig in front of the net. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Moves it to the middle. Couldn't complete the pass. Gaining speed through center, and here they come on the attack. And he takes a shot. And the score. When we have a look at it, James, it looks like it's redirected, and that's just beautiful timing and get the hands away from the body, be able to get it to go the opposite direction of the goaltender. The Bruins, through their hard work and tenacity, have taken a one-goal lead here in the second. It's certainly better to play with the lead, James, but you know that there's a lot of one way left, and your opponent is going to come pushing and pressing. This game has been tight all the way around, and I expect that it will continue to be. Van Riemsdyk's got it along the wing. Moves the puck across to Ekman Larson. Back to the point it goes. And that shot dies in traffic. The Bruins take it along the wall. Taken by Reinhardt. I don't think anybody was hanging on to the puck after that hit. Here's a shot. Mark of this period. Boston's ahead, 1 0. That's a smart read with the two centermen tied up. Across the line along the left wall. Takes the feed. Moves it to the middle. And he shuts down a great scoring chance there. an impressive save. Love looking at this one again, James. You know that this goaltender is dialed in so focused when they're doing everything to get to the puck and keep their opponent at bay. Both teams are set. We'll drop the puck here. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Bobrovsky's a competitor, and he is not afraid to compete for every single puck and outwill and outbattle his opponent. And that highlight reel save, it is something, James, because just when you think it's almost in, he finds a way to get to that puck. Such an athletic goaltender. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Here's a short pass to Grizzly. Oh, a good heads-up play with the poke check. challenge the shooter on this James he didn't sit back in his net he came right out to the top of the paint and said if you're gonna beat me you got to find room well that hit had to hurt James let's have another look at that one I mean he goes down hard and when you have a hit like that you're feeling it all over your body Bokeby's not gonna be able to go here James he's hobbling on one leg clearly a leg injury and he's gonna make his way down the tunnel with some assistance yeah I don't like seeing that at all and you know to see him favoring that foot right now big concern for this squad here going forward the Bruins played along the wing drives to the sweet spot oh big time save by Bobrovsky well, this is an incredible save, James. It's anticipation as well. Recognize that the shooter is in the low slot, getting in front of it and making the save. From the point, they take control of it. And that goes off a stick somewhere in traffic. Looks like we got a delay in tripping penalty coming up here. Well, there's the horn, and that means two periods down. And there's still a critical third to play. Looking forward to this one. Third period action is coming up. out for the remainder of the game, James, with that injury he suffered earlier. We just received word from the staff 
that he will be out for an indefinite amount of time. An unfortunate storyline here throughout the game, and now we know for sure he won't be back. Great save from in tight. Well, he does a great job of having sound position to play based on where the puck is on that low inner spot. And he scores! On the power play, they make it happen. Well, you create offense by moving the puck, and that's exactly what he does here. He knows how to manipulate his opponent to open up the lane, but it's all about the pass. It's got to be on the money if you want to do something with it. The Bruins pick up right where they left off, and look at this, a quick goal here to go up in the third. Yeah, and that's deflating for their opponent. You can see it in the body language, and that's also a signal to them that they need to continue to press attack while they're down. Moves it to McAvoy. Knocked away with the stick by Barkov. And he passes it up ahead to Marchand. Here's a pass and to it. Scores! What a finish on the play! I think the goaltender's still looking for that puck, James. I mean, that was just a quick release. It's a beautiful snapshot that's taken in stride. And it winds up filling the back of the net. The Bruins continue to find offense here in period number three, now making it 3-0 here, Pounder. Well, yeah, they had the intermission, right, James? And they come out of the gate firing just like they started the game. They're up by three, and you got to figure they're going to get a couple more with the amount of shots they're putting through to the net. And that's broken up with a stick in front. make more stops like that, James. Got to reset the momentum for his team. I mean, it's not about what happened or the present moment. It's about the next save, and that's the key contributor to reset this team and get them moving forward. Barkov's won the draw here in their own zone. Ekblad's got it in the defensive end. Quick feed to Barkov. Good use of the body on the play. Moves it quickly over to McAvoy. Here's an odd man rush. Coming to the front of the net, turns it away. The Panthers take possession in the defensive end. Broken up by Berhage. Florida's gained the line and into the zone. Puck grab by Coyle. Gaining momentum up along the side. Shot! Oh my goodness, what a save by Bobrovsky! Oh, tremendous save on the play! What an incredible save, no idea how he got to that one, James, and the shooter is absolutely stuck. Floodgates open, many come. The Panthers haven't had a lot of things go their way tonight, but they finally got a positive here in the third. They're going to have to outnumber their opponent if they want to claw back from this two goal deficit. They're running out of runway. They're going to find a way to get some chances. That goes off the post and stays out. The Panthers showing some frustration there as they hit the post. Listen, you're only down in the game by a little bit. And what a counter punch they serve up. Well, you said a counter punch. You know the coach is going to love this. This quick, timely response. When you look down your bench, you got to know that there's personnel that can go out there and provide some energy for your team. They just did it. You know it's a hard shot when the goaltender gets a big piece of it, but it still trickles in. The Bruins are having themselves a night. They probably don't want this one to end, Pounder. Nah, I wouldn't. If you're patting the stats and you're putting up these kind of numbers, I mean, from start to finish, they've imposed their will on their opponent. The Panthers get a hold of the draw. Puck scooped up by Lindholm. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. The Islanders are coming up for the next game, and I was just told a little while ago that a few extra seats have been released for this one, so if you haven't got your tickets yet, you know what to do. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. 
The Panthers have it now. Slides it over to Verhage. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Boston's in transition. Delayed penalty coming up here. Only out. And now it's grabbed by Verhage. Here we go. He scores! 500 points, 30! That's an incredible milestone that not many get to. James, he just has a way of controlling the game when the puck is on his stick. It's one of those things. He's got the instincts, he's got the vision, and he's got incredible shots. All of that mirrors up into one fantastic player. The Panthers don't have time on their side, but they're starting to scratch back. They're scratching back, they're clawing back, but they're gonna have to take some offensive chances. D are gonna have to start jumping in, opening up lanes, and creating odd man rushes. Handles the pass at center. Frederick's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Continues here, but this crowd still buzzing after what we saw. What a stop that was. Oh, uh, yeah, and they're saying thank you to the goaltender right now, James. They're still on their feet. They're electric right now. And really, it's a nice feeling. Why? Because it doesn't always go this way. So when you have it, you embrace it. Takes a shot. A big time stop there. Here's a blast. Oh, and another big stop. I really like to save James because he challenges the shooter who's all in the slot area. He turns it and into the goal. wide open cage. It's an empty net goal. Uh, and a sigh of relief as well as it's a real insurance marker. You, you put it in the empty cage and you don't ice it, that's a good thing. Gotta love this goal. I mean, he's got the defender just twisted like a pretzel as he's manipulating and showing those silky mitts and then finally puts it away. Boston's had a lot of success tonight on their scoring chances, and look at the result here late in this third period. Saka's quick stick lands on the puck here at center. Along the half wall with the puck. Here he is, shot right in front! And he makes the save on that play. Florida's moving it into the offensive end. We got a whistle, penalty coming up. Christmas called for tripping these off to the box. Carlin Maid has been with us all night, standing by once again at ringside. Pasternak's been fun to watch as he's been able to generate more offense, guys. He's getting my goal in this one. Stop by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. That's all she wrote from this one. The Bruins just had one of those nights where I'm sure everybody in the organization is going home smiling. Well, they should be. They had the puck on their stick, and they retrieved it. And once they retrieved it, their opponent was chasing the game, and that is a wonderful place to be, James. Playing for Canada all those years, I certainly know what that felt like. Well, that puts a bow on the night here this evening from all of us here at EA Sports. I'm James Savalski. See ya.